Okay, uh, hello, good evening to you all. This is Jonathan again. And uh, today I want to take you through on how you can create, on how you can create uh, uh, logic equations and uh, groups using COBOL collect. Yeah, so uh, let's uh, log in to COBOL. We log in to COBOL collection tool. So uh, after logging in, after logging in, we are going to come to any of our any of our forms. I have this. We have some of the questions, and uh, I wanted to first take you through on how you can create a group of questions. What, what do I mean? You create questions, but uh, all those questions go under uh, a group. So let's assume that maybe I want to make these three questions one group, okay. in one group. So uh, you make your cursor to look like this. You're seeing here, it's like a typing, a typing. So you come here, you make sure that it is having those four arrows. So you come and mark this one, then you press on, on control, you come to our second question, press to control, come to our third question. Those are the three questions I want to make, to put in a group. Uh, so after that, we shall, we shall, we shall come on these three, three boxes whereby creates group with selected equations you click on it so once you see it's now a group however you can name your group so let's assume that maybe uh, we are going to make this uh, beneficiary benefit beneficiary beneficiary profile okay so uh, that is our group and then if you want maybe to minimize on your space, you can come and click here. And then you will be able to see only the group names. But once you click on this arrow, you see the questions. That is part of a group. So let's go to our second part. We're going to insert uh, to insert um, logic, like logic, skip logic, into our into our question questions. So uh, this is a status. This is a of beneficiary. 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 Yeah. So once we come here, we are going to see uh, some questions under the status of the beneficiary. Uh, we have: Are you married? Uh, question two, if yes, do you have children? And question three, if you have children, how many do you have? But now we want at least if this guy says, are you married? And I say no. Let's assume that this is a no. Options that we have, yes, no, and I don't know. Let's assume that this person says no. What happens? We want if a beneficiary says, I'm not married, let these two questions not appear. Let them not appear and it goes to your current location. So how do we do this? We're going to come to, we're going to come to this question. This question, we click on this setting. There is this color here. Okay. So once we click there, they bring us options and you, you go to skip logic. So you come here and then just click there and you'll see some selected questions. So you just go to, are you married? You say, yes, I'm married. And now you come to these options here. 
you have to put a yes. This means that this person is married. After that, come here. If you have children, are you married? Yes. Okay. Do you have children? This is the question we are at. If yes, do you have children? And he says, if, if he says yes, well and good, it will bring this second question. If you have children, now let's go here. If you have children, if you have children, we go to still skip logic. Still, we're going to say, are you married? Are you married? Yes. And then here we shall put a yes. And then let's save and see the outcome. Our outcome just come to preview here. And uh, once you preview, let's see this. I think you can see very well. We have a group. You can even close it and see. You see? That's how we can make it. So we start typing in uh, blah, 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 Jonathan, how old are you, 23? And then uh, we come to status. We open the question is under status. So we are seeing. It. You see, the other questions are not there. If we say no, the questions are not coming. But in case we say yes, are you married? Yes. If yes, you have children? Yes. And if you, if you have children, how many do you have? I have three children. You get the point? Yeah, but now let's say no. The questions can disappear. And if I say I don't know, I don't know still, the questions won't come. Yeah, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, I would like to request you to go to our channel, subscribe, like, and share, comment. In case you have any question, just come to us. We shall help you on our email. Thank you so much. Yes, amen. Manikumba. Makumbalo. Hmm? Now, could be the same, right?